I want to see the revenant, but does he actually have sex with a bear? Or is no! It <laughs> Where did you hear that? <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is Saturday. I am a hot mess because I have cleaning this, I have been, good lord, I have been cleaning this apartment so it's not a hot mess for a reason, I will tell you in a moment, that is very, very exciting, but I'm like midway through now, the floors are expertly vacuumed, Louis is hunting for scraps because I am making my delicious spaghetti squash bake, I'll leave the recipe below for anyone who's interested, I have... I think I've shared it a bunch before. Hey guys, I'll share the big news in a second, but first I'm watching The Bachelor with this one. Aw, I love you, Heo. Look at Louis. He's in his like happiest state. He's with you though. Who do you guys think is gonna win The Bachelor? My money is on Lauren B. I think they just have like a special connection and Ben cries when he talks about her. But I also read an article about how he's very, very Christian and it's weird to me that they never talk about his faith because I feel like there's a big chunks of conversations being cut out. So TBD though. The big news is that in a little bit, a friend of mine that I know from school, Alex, got in touch with me and he's filming this little docu-series all about different creative people and he shoots for an hour and edits for an hour and then uploads a one minute video so i'm going to be featured in that series talking about youtube and stuff hopefully i manage to do it in a way where i don't sound like a pompous dick but tbd though bye heel Bye -bye. Hey guys, Hillary just left. I'm hanging out in my apartment and guess who's here? Actually, I can't even say guess because they don't know who you are. My friend Alex from high school is here. Check him out. Love the J's wear. And he has a project. What is your project, Alex? I do a weekly video series with someone that I find interesting. Uh, the point is to promote my documentary company. I make movies with families and businesses and couples, going into their homes, interviewing them, uh, taking their photos and iPhone videos and stuff and making it into a story basically. So in order to promote that, I am meeting with someone I find interesting every week, interviewing them for an hour, and then I spend an hour turning it into a one minute video. Yay! <laughs> so I'm going to be a subject for this week. Well, I don't know, that might be an overpromise, but I'm going to talk about YouTube and stuff like that. I will leave links below um, to wherever it is. I'll tweet about it if you want to follow me at Chilean Tweets. Jillian Tweets, not Chilean. Promo though. And uh, I will let you guys know where to find it, but it should be pretty interesting. I'll talk to you when we're done talking about YouTube. Hi Alex. Was I a good subject? Yes. Time will tell. Time will tell. This is the part where you guys find out that this entire channel has been an elaborate facade and I'm just a performance artist. Good morning guys. I have a feeling this vlog is going to be pretty short only because Friday I wasn't doing much. Saturday was, well, talking to Alex and I couldn't show too much of that because I want some content left for his video. And oh, spotless for the most part. Louis says hi. And today I am going to go get a new work bag because I want something that's really, really, really lightweight. So I'm wearing my favorite shopping outfit. You've probably seen it before. It looks like this. Check it out, guys. Leggings and a tank top. And that way I get to try stuff on without using that change room. I'm a pro, guys. I've really like figured out how to make shopping work for me. So anyway, that's gonna be today. Tonight I'm gonna be watching the Oscars. I want to make sure I get this vlog up before that starts because I usually like to have it posted early enough that I can stay up and read and answer comments. But I'm thinking of periscoping the red carpet and maybe the Oscars. So go find me on Periscope, follow me on Jillian Scopes, that is my username there, if you wanna watch the Oscars with me. Uh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's hit up the bay. Find me a work bag. So maybe some work clothes. Hmm? Hmm? Guys, it is finally warm enough to be outside in a jacket. 
This is from Target forever ago. These sunglasses are from Westward Leaning. But now it's time to go into the bay. Guys, I kind of really like this gold swatch watch. It's showing up really rose gold, but it's like a true gold and it's very flat. I kind of like it. The new setting here, or the new setup here, is completely disorienting. I've been up and down and up and down. The signage isn't totally clear, so I think the bay is having some growing pains. But also, look how cute this is. Love it. All right, here's the Kipling stuff. Let's see if we can find something I like. Ooh, there's lots of options. Kind of like this. Kind of like this. Guys, I'm caught between these two choices. This gray, what is this one, a Kellen? I like it because it has pink on the inside and it has a shoulder strap. And then this black one that might be a little bit more practical. I don't know, man. What do I want? This one's called Leah. Guys, I just stopped by Hillary's place to show her the video that's up that Alex did, so I will link it down below. It's like, I don't know, it's a bit of a different take on me because it's pretty serious, but it was fun to share it with her and like stuff like that. Are you having a good day today? Yeah. I just ate like an entire chicken. No. I'm so full. Do you have any opinions on Oscar movies? I didn't see any of them. I spotlight nominated. I feel like it is. Yeah. It was up for Golden Globe. And I, that is insane. It's insane. The movie was terrible. Like Why, the subject why matter, terrible? Because it just wasn't good. It was so boring. And the acting was just bad. And the dialogue was just lame. It wasn't exciting. Tell us how you really feel. I just was like, I cannot... Like, and I just started watching movies again, so for me it's like a big effort to watch an entire movie. And I was like, boring! The whole time. <laughs> the whole time. And I forgot what it was even about after I watched it. Part of me is like, we should see The Revenant, but a larger part of me I is like, we it. would hate that movie. I feel like I'd be into it though. Really? It's a man in the woods. I don't know, I don't know much about Alone. it. Alone. I don't know if I've even seen any of the other ones. Guys, I just only saw Gravity like a month ago. <laughs> I'm a couple years behind. What yeah. other movies are there? Have you seen any of them? I don't know. I want to know why Magic Mike Double XL was robbed of a nomination. <laughs> best picture though. Yeah, best picture for real. Channing Tate. No, what's his name? You know, the other guy, the guy who stole the Joe movie. Joe Mangello. Joe Mangello, best actor. Comes out in the tux, if he does won, the dance. That would be everything. Well, he's not nominated. Everything. I want to see The Revenant, but does he actually have sex with a bear? Or is no! It <laughs> Where did you hear that? <laughs> oh know. my gosh, no! He, he gets mauled by a bear. He doesn't have sex with a bear. Wait, don't tell me if he dies or not. I think you just, your brain didn't compute the movie's publicity materials. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> that was like, <laughs> You're a maniac. Guys, it kind of kills me that Hillary is like not coming to watch this movie tonight. But you'll text yeah. me, right? Yeah, and I'm gonna fall asleep at like 8 p.m. So what do I care? Yeah. I'll just like find the best clips online. I'm like, I didn't see any of these movies. I'm so sweaty, you guys. Look. Shiny. All right, guys, this is where I bid you adieu. I am just looking at the stuff that I got. I'll show you quickly. This is the Kipling bag I got. I almost went for the other one and then I realized this one is much more practical because it's really light. It is the Johanna style and it was 120 Canadian and it came with this cute little monkey. So I'm excited. And then this Kenzie sweater was on sale at the Bay. And I like it because it's big and chunky and it was $99 and I got it for $29.70 and it's just super soft and lovely. Anyway, I am going to say goodnight. I'm going to start watching the red carpet in a little bit. Leave me a comment, let me know how your week was. I love hearing from you guys. That is my favorite, favorite thing about YouTube is 
hearing back, like this video if you're into weekend vlogs, and I will see you next week. Love you, bye though.